Hey guys, it's Kyle again and welcome back to Modern Warfare 3 Season 3. So we finally completed the Battle Pass. It only took five weeks. But yeah, today we're checking out the Fated variant for the MTZ-762. It's the final variant, like I just said. Obviously, you've got to complete the Battle Pass in order to get it. And yeah, we're just going to get to some gameplay. I'm sorry that it's took me this long to get the Battle Pass completed. I've been prioritizing making videos and uploading every single day. I've also changed my approach, what type of videos I wanted to upload this season. I wanted to do a different variety of videos rather than doing only battle pass variants straight away And I think that's ended up causing me to not get all of these battle pass variants done quick enough So next season season 4 I'm obviously going to keep doing the sniping content and all the events But I'm prioritizing battle pass variants until I've got them all done But yeah, we're just going to get into some gameplay of this tier 100 variant And as always guys if you enjoy these variant videos be sure to like and subscribe for more because we'll be doing the same thing again in season four this is a class i made around the variant i pretty much took the underbarrel off for a magazine because this thing only has 20 rounds you can't put the conversion kit on it messes it up pretty much apart from the barrel all of these attachments are pretty good if you wanted the better barrel you could put it on but this thing is very strong i haven't used the mtz in a while but it's very strong so you don't really need the barrel but obviously if you wanted the best possible attachments i'd put on i'd put on the jack bfb you don't have to have an optic but i kept it on i'd put on a stock or a laser these are the perks I always use. I usually use marksman gloves on snipers, but for red guns, you could use commander or scavenger gloves. And yeah, guys, enjoy the video. Alright, so this is what the variant looks like. It's a decent looking variant. I wouldn't say it's worth putting as a tier 100 variant. You obviously had the animated variant in season one. I think it was for the hold during season one. It was one of the animated lava variants. Ugh. Almost died. This is my first time playing this map, by the way. This is pretty much like the far end of Rebirth Island. Don't know if you guys recognize it, but yeah, this is a section of Rebirth Island. This is one of two POI locations from the Warzone map. There's this, and then there's that tank map, which is apparently a section of... I don't even know what the name of the Warzone map is. I don't know if it's a part of, like, Vondel or Urzikstan. Get out. Oh, I so almost had it. This is my first time playing this map, by the way. Feels pretty good. There's a lot of people that didn't like that other map from Modern Warfare 2 that was a section of Vondel. I think it was called District. People didn't like it because of the way, I don't know, just the way it worked, but I loved it. It works really well in hard point for me. This map for domination at least, it feels pretty good. It's very small. This final section where the A flag is does seem a bit flawed, I guess. Because they've taken the whole open base area. The MTZ, by the way, is so strong. It's nice that they haven't just directly ripped it from that location and they've actually cut off certain areas. Like, I was a bit confused for a second because the building at the far end over there, you can't access it. Oh, it's just not there, but it's basically been cut off. Those of you that played Rebirth Island, you'll know what section I'm talking about. The little building. Yeah, this one here. They put a barrier around it. What do you guys think of this map? What do you guys think of this variant? It's not worth being a tier 100 variant, but it's a decent variant, so it'll do, I guess. I'm sorry that it took this long to complete the battle pass. We're in the fifth week. Back on Modern Warfare 2, when pretty much all I had to upload was variant videos. I would complete the battle pass in around about two weeks. But we're in the fifth week now of season three. I'll defend myself in saying that I haven't really had a lot of time to grind the battle pack or just grind the game on a consistent basis. Purely because I've had to grind all of these videos, like editing all of them. I've double uploaded almost every single weekend of the season i literally never double upload i weren't double uploading on weekends when this game first came out i don't think i was 
Yeah, what I'm trying to say is that I've been a bit too slow this season. I know most people won't really care about the final Battle Pass variant, but I don't really care. I'm covering it anyway. This is definitely the weakest out of all three tier 100 variants. The one last season was an attack evolver, I think. I know most people don't really care about attack evolver, but the purple variant it gave you, it did look good. But yeah, I know why it's taken me so long to get this done. And like I just said, I've been grinding the videos. If I can manage to get a video out every single day for the rest of this season, this might end up being the longest daily upload streak I've ever had. I've actually not mentioned this at all. But if you guys don't watch my old videos or if you're new around here, please like and subscribe for more content like this. But in the past, I used to do this thing called 25 days of Christmas. I wasn't capable of uploading every single day in the past. So what I used to do was every year from December 1st to the 25th Christmas day, I would upload every single day. I did it for 2019, 2021. I managed to get it done almost every single time. But in 2022, I did almost get it done but i ended up prioritizing doing videos over my health because back in 2022 christmas time i got covid the first and only time and i was just ill for the whole month i was prioritizing making videos and i just ended up being ill the whole time so i decided that was the last time i was gonna do 25 days of christmas and now here we are in 2024 almost uploading every single day if i upload every day for the rest of the season i could end up uploading every single day over a two month period for the first time ever but yeah next season i'm gonna try and prioritize battle pass variants if i'm gonna double up world i will be doing battle pass variants every single day to get them out of the way first okay guys that's it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed like i always say if you are new around here be sure to like and subscribe for more and i will see you on the next video